Good morning, and welcome to Morning Manna. Today is Wednesday, October the 6th, 2021, and this is episode 3647. My name is Bruce Turner. Welcome to today's Morning Manna. Today's episode is titled, A Colossal Word. Stay tuned. So today I was reading the YouVersion verse of the day and I decided to expand to read the entire chapter and oh my goodness, what a powerful, powerful word that the Apostle Paul gives in his writing to the Colossians. That's why I call this a colossal word, right? The word colossal means of great size, extent, or amount, enormous, a great scope or consequence, monumental, (laughs) of enormous size, gigantic, huge. I want to share with you from the book of Colossians chapter 3, verses 12 through 17. It's a powerful word. It is so colossal. (laughs) It is so full of admonition that we need today. And it's all in this one little spot. So let me read it to you. Therefore, as the elect of God, holy and beloved, put on tender mercies, kindness, humility, meekness, long-suffering, forbearing with one another and forgiving one another if anyone has a complaint against another, even as Christ forgave you, so you also must do. Now, he addresses us as holy and beloved. Listen, Our holiness isn't a result of our good works. We have been made holy. We have been made righteous by our faith in the death, burial, and resurrection of Jesus Christ on the cross. And you and I are holy. Yes, you are the elect of God. You are holy. You are beloved. And because we are, He gives us this list of things that is just so powerful. It is colossal. Put on tender mercies, kindness, humility, meekness, long-suffering, bearing with one another and forgiving one another. If anyone has a complaint against another, even as Christ forgave you, so you also must do. Christ forgave us so much, and we have him as an example. And so with everything that you're facing, everything that a lot of people are facing, may I just encourage you to focus on mercy and kindness and humility and meekness long-suffering, putting up with stuff, forgiving. Listen, but above all these things, put on love, which is the bond of perfection. Listen, if you don't have enough for your mission statement today in this particular passage of Scripture, I don't know where you're going to get it, but listen, this is what we need. Verse 15 says, And let the peace of God rule in your hearts, to which also you were called in one body, and be thankful. Be thankful. Let the word of Christ dwell in you richly in all wisdom, teaching and admonishing one another in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, singing with grace in your hearts to the Lord. And then he wraps it all up, this colossal word by saying, and whatever you do in word or deed, do all in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. 
This is a colossal word. May I encourage you today to spend some time reading over, meditating over this passage of Scripture, Colossians three twelve through 17. Maybe take some notes on it. Where is God speaking to you? Where is your focus need to be in this colossal word? Father, thank you so much. Thank you so much for your word. Thank you for how powerful it is that we can let the word dwell in us richly in all wisdom, teaching and admonishing us. Lord, help us today to practice this in our lives. In Jesus' name, amen. Thanks for listening today. Hope you're having a great day. Thanks for your prayers. Till tomorrow morning, this is Bruce reminding you to choose joy.